James Purdy and Son, the most famous of all of the gun makers, the most well-known, the most renowned. I mean, they built some absolutely span fantastic guns. They still do today. Between the wars, the 1930s is the most renowned period in Purdy's history as far as gun collectors are concerned. And I have an absolutely superb pair of guns here, built in 1937. Um, retaining virtually all of their original hardening colour and finish. Lightweight specification, 28 inch barrels, 15 inch stocks, and retaining virtually all of their original hardening colour. Um, the classic Purdy rose and scroll engraving remaining. And just an extremely good lightweight pair of guns. The 1930s is really the golden era of gun making. Classic pair of Purdy's from that period are very sought after for a variety of reasons. This particular pair, though, have another ace up their sleeves. Not only do they remain in extraordinarily good condition, the other remarkable feature these guns have is who they were built for. They were built in 1937 for American um, executive William S. Paley. Now, Paley's name might not jump out at you, but Paley was the man responsible for turning CBS from a small regional network of 16 radio stations into the nationwide and ultimately worldwide radio and television giant that it became. These were his pair of Purdy's, and as you can see, just a superb pair of Between the Wars guns.